Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining me today for chair, uh, for chair Fitness with Petra. We are on Minnesota Key on the intercoastal waterway here in Venice, south of, actually in Englewood, south of Venice. And we'll start with warming up first. As always, if you feel any pain, I would like you to stop. If you feel tired or fatigued, please take a break. We'll start walking in place. This is chair fitness, so we won't be getting up at all today. Let's walk in place. Toe, heel, toe, heel. The opposite is that you would do if you actually walk, you would walk heel, toe. So let's mimic that heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe. Bring your toes up, curl them back, curl them back, curl them back. Bring your heels back, jump on the toes, up and down, up and down. And we'll start walking, heel toe, up front, punch the opposite arm forward here, sitting tall as always. Glad you joined me today. Put it on the TV is the first step, or putting on your laptop, turning it on is the first step to exercising and being active. Keep your legs going to the front while your arms go to the side. Both arms out and in, out and in. Now punch your arms, both arms to the front, one leg at a time. You should be getting warmed up. That's the idea of this exercise. Punch, punch, punch. Forward again and we'll start rolling our shoulders back. Circle back here, circle back, roll back. Bring one arm up and reach and lean, and reach and lean. We are doing it three times on one side. Bring it back, twist, 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 twist. Bring it back, roll your shoulders back again, and we are ready to start working with your ball. You do need a ball and a band. I don't have the flat band today, I have the rolled band, but it does the same purpose. So bring your ball between your palms, the ball between your knees, sorry for that, hold squeeze and relax, hold squeeze and relax, hold squeeze, hold squeeze. Working your inner thigh here, keep your abdominals tight, you're nice and tight. Hold it, work those inner thigh, keep your abdominals tight, everything is tight. You're working those muscles, I feel like an ant on me. Exhale as you push, push together, push together. Now come on your toes and keep squeezing that ball, squeeze, squeeze. So we are on the bike path, as you noticed, right at the end here. And one gentleman was kind enough to come back in the field. Push, hold, and push and hold. Anything to entertain you, right? Push and hold. Bring your heels down. Now you're going to kick one leg down forward, one leg only. Squeeze the ball at the same time as you push up, push up, extending your leg and bending your leg. Let's do the other side. Exhale, kick forward. Bring your legs down and relax a little bit. Take the ball out. Now hold the ball between both palms. You're sitting upright, push together here, working your chest and relax. Push together, exhale as you push and relax. My ball is on the softer side. <clears throat> so you see I can really squeeze it tight, working my chest, focusing on that. Sitting tall, 
We're doing three more, two more, last one. Circle your arms, circle, relax your hands on that ball. Relax, great job, keep it up. So we did a little bit for your legs, we did a little bit for your upper body, going back to your legs here. Place the ball under your right foot and roll it from the heel to the toe. Toe, heel, heel, toe. Back and forth, back and forth. You feel your knee working, your ankle, and a little bit of your hip. And now we'll circle it under your foot. Don't lose it. Let's go the other direction. Let's roll it again. Heel, toe, heel, toe. Now bring it a little closer and push down. Pretend you're getting up, but you're not. Push down. Movement comes from your hip joint. Work those muscles. Your leg is really tight here. Exhale as you push, 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 push. Four, three, two, last one. Let's move that ball to the other foot. And we're rolling it from the heel to the top. Heel, toe, heel, toe. It's nice and breezy here. It's all the sunny and we have all these puffy clouds overhead with the blue sky. It's a gorgeous day out here. Roll it forward and back. Now circle that ball. Circle the other direction. Let's roll it one more time from the heel to the toe. Then move it back to your foot, a little closer to your chair and push down. Push down as if you're getting up. This is a movement that comes from your hip. Push, push, push. Exhale as you do so. I hope you're enjoying these exercises stay with me keep joining me for these classes they're excellent for your health as well as for your mental health besides your physical health push down and push down two more now place the ball between both feet start raising your legs up extending them hold briefly working all of your legs and bring it back down exhale come down push up bring it down you to move your hands around each other. Move your hands around each other. Circle, circle, circle. Go the opposite way with your hands now. Extending your legs up and down, up and down. And relax a little bit. Shake it out. Take the ball, place it by the side and shake out your legs here. We're going for the band now. As I said, I don't have the flat band. I think I have an ant in my shirt. <laughs> Um, let's just take a quick cut here and then I'll come right back after this. What yeah, I have an end in my shirt. Can you help me? Uh, let's just let it work. All right, so now we have the band and I'd like you to bring the band behind your back under your arms. We're working your chest here. If your band is short, you can hold on the handles. If it's too easy, hold behind your handles. Turn your palms so they face down. Extend your arms to the front, bring it back. Exhale, push and push. Exhale as you push. Focus on the chest. Palms face down, they are about chest height. Two more coming to the front. Now hold that band a little shorter. We're going out to the side. That's the easiest one. Come out, bring it back. Exhale as you come out. Bring it back, we're going overhead, so hold your hand long. 
or hold your band very long, palms face me as you bring it up and make sure your band is under your arms so it doesn't roll off your back. Bring it up overhead, exhale as you push up, working the top of your shoulders, your upper back. Bring it back down, let's roll your shoulders back, relax your head. Turn your head right and left, bring the chin even down to relax a little, bring it up. Let's do the other side and bring your chin down. Good, bring it forward now. We'll keep the band here, roll your hands around the band. It's easier to hold on, palms face out, about chest height and a little wider than shoulder width apart. Bring it out slowly, bring it back in. Exhale as you bring it out and bring it back in. Exhale. And remember as always, if you feel any pain, I'd like you to stop, take a break. If you feel fatigued, catch your breath. If you're out of breath, exhale. Three more, two more, your last one, and bring it down, roll your shoulders back again, turn your head, bring it back in the middle, we'll place your right foot on top of the bend for this, I'd like you to slide forward, bring your right foot under your bend, you can wrap the handles around you, the bend around your hands on the hand, hold on to the handles, Bend your knee and you're kicking out. Extend, bend, exhale. Bring your leg down and hold both ends of your handle in the opposite hand. Now in your left hand, you're going out to your right. Abduction, outer thigh. We worked your inner thigh with the ball before, so now we're doing a seated exercise for your outer thigh. Abduction here. Keep going. Six more. Five, four, three, two. Your last one. Bring it back in the center. Place your left foot on top and bring your right foot out. And we'll start with the short one. Hold your bend short, bend your knee, lean back on your, so you touch the back rest, extend and bend, push out. <sighs> Exhale every time when you push out. Six, five, four, three, two, last one, and come upright. Place both ends of your handles in your right hand, sitting tall, move your leg to the left, bring it out. Bring it back, exhale. Oh, two more right here, two. Last one, bring it back in the middle. Place your right foot as well on the top, uh, band now. Bring your feet closer, elbows in your waist. You're sitting upright and we'll start doing a bicep curl. Pull it up to your shoulders and bring it back. If you have the flat band, wrap it around your hand so you don't have to hold on so hard or so tight. Exhale as you come up, inhale going down. Last one, turn your palms here, relax a little bit, shake it out. And we'll turn your palms, palms face down, now elbows in your waist, reverse bicep curl. Bring it up, bring it down, exhale as you bring it up. Eight, nine, ten, two more here please, two. Last one, and relax. 
roll the shoulders and again turn your head bring your palms forward they face down you're holding the bend you're pulling it up to the front alternating my bend is short so I won't get high Relax a little bit, then we'll bring them out to the side and pull up here. Keep your arms long. Arms long, it's not a bicep curl. Exhale, exhale. One more. And bring the bend by the side. Great job, everybody. Relax your hands a little bit. Let's play the piano. And let's scratch a cat next. Circle, bring it up, 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 up. And bring it back down. Up, up, up. And down. Now relax your wrist, turn your wrist circle. We'll go the other way. Bring your thumb to each finger three times. One, two, three, one, two, three. And we're going back again. Circle again, relax your wrist, go both ways. We'll take the bend one more time. We'll do your tricep with the bend. I'm holding the handle. You can, if you have flat bend, just hold it in your hand. Grab the bottom part around your hand, sit sideways. You're extending your arm up today. Usually we go down. I'd like you to go up. Exhale as you come up. Bring it down. We'll do the other side. So reverse it. Hold the Handle in this side, wrap your band around your hand here, holding it short. This arm stays tucked in your waist and this arm is moving, bend and extend. it back down, place the bend by the side, this was it for the bends, relax your hands a little bit, we'll do a little bit more leg work, I'd like you to sit back in your chair, upright, you can lean back, it's a back rest, we'll start on your right leg, extend your leg, circle, the movement comes from your hip. And we'll reverse it, go the other direction. One, bring it down and shake out your legs. Give it a little stretch in between before we do the other side. Circle, movement comes from the hip again. And let's go the other direction. And bend your knee, shake it out, relax. Walk your feet out, your toes are pointing out, come up on your toes, stay up on your toes, tightening your calves. At the same time, you're giving your ex yourself extra resistance, pushing down on your knees. Create a tension, hold it in your tummy as well. Core is tight, hold it and relax. Push down again, hold. So it's an isometric contraction here, relax. Push up, hold. Relax, push against the knees. Relax, we'll do three more. Hold it tight. Relax, two more. Relax, last one. And relax, walk your feet back in. We're going to go for a little run here. I'd like you to start walking, walking, walking. Get your arms involved. 
Now we're going to go for a little run. Quick, 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 as quick as you can. Keep your legs and movement short. Your arms are going fast. Movement is short. Keep going, going, going. So you're getting out of breath a little bit. You're getting out of breath a little bit. That's it. Five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Walk it, walk it. Now bring your knee up and touch it with the opposite hand. Touch, touch, touch. It's called a high knee if you're up on your feet, but now it's a high knee seated as well with a little diagonal twist here. Bring your legs up higher, touch the inner side of your calves. If you can, touch your ankles. Bring it back down, shake it out, relax a little. We are getting ready to abdominals, to do your abdominal sit-ups. Bring your feet forward, slide forward in your chair, lean back. Cross your arms over your chest or you have them on your thighs. Don't hold on to your armrest. You don't want to use your arms, you want to use your core to pull yourself up. One inch off the backrest. Now hold it right here. Keep your abdominals tight, please. Hold, hold, hold and relax exhale come up hold five four three two one and relax let's come up hold one two three four five relax come up hold one two three four and five last one come up hold this is ten nine eight seven six five four three two one and relax ah let's lean forward hug behind your knees drop the head down relax pull yourself down very slowly come back up Send your right leg out, bend your left knee, hinge forward from the waist, lean forward, pushing on the thigh, keep your leg straight, left leg is straight, you're looking down, head is in line with your spine, come back upright, let's do it again, reach and push down, lean forward a little bit more, you feel it in your lower back here, come back up, let's switch sides, extend your left foot, push down on your thigh here, and come up let's do it one more time exhale push come back up again bring the soles of your feet together push on the knees lean forward exhale as you lean down relax your neck push on your knees opening your hips and very slowly come back up if you can cross your legs, I'd like you to cross your left leg over your right leg. Sit tall, bring both palms on the outside of your left thigh, twist to the left and hold. Relax, let's do the other side. Again, if you're allowed to cross over, cross your right knee over. Sit tall, hold on the outside of your right thigh and pull yourself around. Give yourself some torque on your spine. It's a great stretch. And come back in the center and cross your legs. Bring both arms out, lock your elbows. Flex your palms up, turn your thumbs back. Feel a good stretch in your forearms here. All the way into your upper arm and turn your thumbs down. Bring one arm up, reach and lean. Stay here with me. Bring it back, let's do the other side. And bring your arm up again, left arm, reach diagonal forward, getting the back here. Bring it down, let's do the other side, reach and lean. And bring it back down. Come back upright, clasp your fingers, rotate inside out. That's what you get for taping in nature. Today we have lots of ends. Bring your arms out to the side and circle. 
circle. Circle the shoulders. Let's go back, circle. And there's a fisherman nearby. He keeps catching fish, which is very nice. I'm sure his wife is happy to cook it tonight. Now bring one arm across. Gently pull on your shoulder. Keep your shoulder down. Look straight at me. Don't turn or twist. Now let's do the other side. Gently hold, pull. Bring it back. Let's inhale. Ah, gather the air. Take a deep breath. Bring it down. And again, inhale. Ah, deep breath. Bring it down. One more. Inhale. Ah, and bring it down. Thank you for joining me today for Chair Fitness. It was a pleasure to work with you, and I hope to see you again next time. Take care. Bye-bye.